And we are back. We're back at Cisco Live US 2023. Isn't it amazing to see everything back in full swing? It's really cool. It's, the, the DevNet zone has been built out so nicely. The whole show floor has been amazing today. Um, and my favorite part, honestly, is the lighting. The lighting in the DevNet zone and the colors just the look colors. so vibrant. It just makes you feel excited to be it here. It is. It, it's, it's a different look, something very different than what we've had in the past. So I'm excited, and I'm excited to see the crowds back to normal, yeah. You know, getting that full vibe of how we feel at a Cisco Live event. So it, it's great to see it. We have some really, really awesome things happening in the DevNet Zone this round. We have a lot of technical demos mm -hmm. that we started off with. So one of the first things that I saw was this massive setup of the DevDash. It's pretty awesome. It's really cool. It is our gamification of you know, IoT, race cars, a bunch of cool Legos there, and really getting to flex your programmability muscles. Answer a bunch of questions, get yourself on a leaderboard, watch those cars go around the track. It's a lot of fun. Yeah. Another one that I, the cool demo was the API Insights. Mm -hmm. um, you're able to check your technical documentation, find quality issues ahead of time. We've had this for some time, but it's picking up more and more traction each year. It's something that we're using inside Cisco and we're making, we've made it available for anybody outside of Cisco as well. So we're using it with our products. You can use it with your applications in your own business. It's, it's, it's really amazing the capabilities yeah. it has. There's another thing that we've actually added this round is the, the Cisco metrics search engine. Mm -hmm. It was very interesting because you can actually pull out telemetry data, mm -hmm. right? Um, and you can pull out dashboards and, and kind of explain that telemetry data in a visual format. Yeah, it's one of the it's one of the staples that I think everybody in the technology industry in general always needs is how do you take the data that is available to you in various places in your environment and actually be able to visualize it and make decisions based off of it. So yeah. it's great that we have yeah. that available now. And then we had our CEO, Chuck Robbins, yes. visit us. It was uh, interesting. We had we showed him around the DevNet zone. He felt he seemed excited about our golf demo. Our demo in golf is actually linked to a charity. Every hole that they made, every every day that they played, it's actually all going as a contribution from the DevRel team over to the first tee of Silicon Valley. So that was really awesome. Um, another thing that we had is our community uh, lightning talk. Um, it's been, this is the first time we're actually doing this. We actually had some community leaders um, come in, stop by, do a lightning talk, and it was a lunch and learn. So it was really exciting to actually have that. To round the entire day out, Ray Stevenson, our leader of developer relations at Cisco, uh, gave a talk on you know building customized dashboards uh, using PowerPoint of all things, which you might seem strange at first, but it's a t you know these tools that we have available to us on all of our desktops, oftentimes in a company, exactly. can be used for more than just a simple presentation. Yeah. It's it really does show you the power of a programmable interface for your products and your networked environment with simple tools like PowerPoint. Well, not simple, it's a, it's a very robust tool, but very it gives you a lot of Widely used one, for sure. Right. <laughs> it gives you a lot of flexibility and a lot of options, and yet another way to make the data that's available in your environment accessible to right. more people. Yeah, yeah. So it was an exciting day today, and we hope you were able to catch up. If you're not able to, uh, to be here in person, have no fear. We actually have a lot of this content online for our online viewers, so make sure you visit the links throughout this uh, update. Um, check out our daily updates. We're going to be putting in more content, more information on developer.cisco.com slash Cisco Live throughout this event and on our main page on developer.cisco.com otherwise. <laughs> <laughs>